Everybody ready? Here we go. Welcome. Repairing the Breach Ministries. My name is Pastor Eddie Myers. I'll be teaching. Teaching the Bible study tonight. <clears throat> and tonight, we're going to be coming out. We've just finished up. Oh, what was that we just finished up? Angels. Just finished up angels. Now we're going to go on to, we're going to go on to communion. And welcome everybody that came with us, those that are here and, and joining us in online. <coughs> welcome you all. Welcome everybody here to our Thursday night Bible study here, Repairing the Breach Ministries. Let's start out in prayer. Open us, open up in prayer. Dear Father, we thank you and we praise you, dear Lord, for being with us and guiding and keeping and standing on with us, dear Father. We thank you for giving everyone safe travels and safety throughout this whole day, dear Father, in the name of Jesus, dear Lord. For, we thank you for surrounding us with your angels of protection, for guiding and keeping and standing on with us in everything that we've done, dear Father. And I pray unto you in the name of Jesus, dear Father, as we enter into uh, enter into this uh, Bible study, dear Father, I pray unto you in the name of Jesus to stand and guide and be with us, dear Father. Continue on blessing us, dear Lord, in the name of Jesus, and watching over, guiding, and keeping us. At my, I pray, dear Father, remind everyone want to be in continuous prayer to enter in united and uh, united as one dear father and to this your bible study dear lord that you were that all will receive the the fullness of your uh, of the <clears throat> the word that you have for us tonight dear father I pray unto you, dear Father, to uh, let there be no distur no, no dis disturbances or in any interruptions, dear Father, um, upon any of the homes, uh, homes uh, or anywhere that that uh, our brothers and sisters in Christ will, will be joining us, dear Father. Any of your any one of your hungry that's joining us, dear Father, be no disturbances or interruptions, dear Father, that we may receive the fullness of your word, dear Father. And I pray unto you, dear Lord, just to guide and keep and stand with us, be in the midst of this Bible study, dear Father, as we come together in, in the name of Jesus, dear Father. In Jesus' name we thank you and we praise you, dear Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Alright, here, let's open up to 1 Corinthians chapter 11. And we're going to start at, we're going to start at uh, verse, verse 23. <coughs> Talking about communion. We're going to get try. We're going to try to get up to verse 25, or even verse 26. But if not, like we always do, we'll just continue on next week. All right, communion uh, <coughs> started with, with and, and with Christ. <coughs> Christ start. This is hit the the new covenant as we'll go over the the new covenant that He has put forth. With to to everyone that accepts accepts him as their personal savior, and, and it's done to to in, in remembrance in 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 uh in letting in in, in remembrance of him as like like uh, like the like we said that like the, um his word God our Father's word says and in, in remembrance of him and. <coughs> For everyone that receives it, and there, there's some. Uh, before we get there, there, there's some churches that that have open communion, which uh, that that they allow everyone to take part in, in it, whether they're saved or or not saved, or what, whether they whether they uh, have readied themselves, as we'll go over in in the in uh, as we go on further with this, and some have. Um, close communion where where there there's only uh, they only serve those those that have accepted Christ as their personal savior, which uh, <clears throat> with that they, they with those churches that that have closed take taken uh, upon uh, upon how's it how's it how would you say it Father uh, not wanting uh, the guilt put upon the church of those that have not uh have not been uh, have not uh uh accept the Christ as a personal savior that don't know the significance of taking um part of, of this uh, of his communion and so here what we're gonna start we're gonna start here and, and whatever it is any questions or statement just just speak up all right here 
Stay at verse 23. Oh, chapter, I'm sorry. 1 Corinthians chapter 11. All right, everybody ready? All right, verse 23. For I have received of the Lord that which I delivered unto you, that Jesus, the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread. Now, the first, the, 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 <coughs> the first part of the, the first line of this, well, in my Bible, it's the first line. Saying, for I have received of the Lord. This is, is, is telling, is, is a telling part of this, that, that he has not received this ordinance of man. He, he did not, he, he was not, uh, <coughs> how is it, for? he was not given, given it by man. He was, it was not delivered uh, by man, but it was delivered um, by, by, to him by God himself by by the uh how's it the revelation that that God has given them of the uh of communion just as um in let's see what chapter is that father and and turn to galatians I turn use this bible galatians chapter uh chapter chapter 1 Verse 11 and verse 12. Well, here Paul is saying, But I certify, certify you, brethren, that the gospel which was preached of me is not after man. For, for, neither, rece <coughs> for neither receive it of, for, for I neither received it of man, neither was I taught it, but by revelation of Jesus Christ. This is Paul saying, saying how th th this word, how this word comes forth. It's it, it's not in. It, it's not in. It's not given to him by uh, or, or taught by any of of the disciples uh, of the disciples that walked with Christ. It was not taught by by him through to them. It was taught. Uh, it, it, it just as uh, Christ had called him out, whenever he was uh, going to persecute the churches, he was given he, he was given all everything that that he uh, and all and all the letters and all the uh, 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 words that he spoke was it was given by Christ, given by Christ himself. That's why he he's saying here in, in uh, uh, Galatians he, he said uh, which the God the, that gospel. That that the gospel, which was preached, after uh, of me is not after man, for for I received it not uh, not for for I neither received it of man neither was taught was taught it, but by <clears throat> the revelation of Jesus Christ. There there's no there there's nothing of himself in it, and it just as each. Each and every pastor, each and every minister, each everyone that that everyone that that uh, those that teach Sunday school, those that teach uh, um, what was that summer? What was what, that? Vacation. Yeah, vacation Bible school. Anyone that that is is, is uh, has has been called out by God to do uh, His work to speak to to His hungry. <coughs> is it it is not to be direct. Is not to be. Uh, received anything of man and and uh it's some some of the draw some of some of the uh uh what is that father some some of the handicaps that that has been uh that that people have put upon themselves is that they they way that they will way more in of the opinion of a person, rather than the 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 uh, uh, the, the fact that that God um, of what God can teach them, right? Like saying that that uh, they will they will 
if a person is called out, if God has called a person out to preach, if God has uh, <coughs> that in the person in the person is is under the tutelage of uh, of of some of a of a pa or they're underneath the past being taught by them and and, and that sometimes it, it will become uh, it will become a stumbling block because they will put more credibility upon what that pastor says and even before more even more so than 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 God than God himself that that they will uh go upon uh that pastor's opinion rather than uh praying for themselves and and and, and learning for themselves and, and that that's that's where a, a lot of a lot of uh what how is that for a, a lot of um misteachings come a lot of uh, a lot of stumbling blocks uh, occur that way that there is um that there there is there is a uh, uh, there is that 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 uh, handicap of teaching what what you were what you were taught by somebody else and, and, and instead of praying and asking the Lord because only only God can um, only God can can teach what it is that needs to be taught in a in a certain area that's why that that's why I hear that that uh um, and the Bi that's why the Bible has so many books in it. Like the Lord taught, uh, uh, well, I don't know if that wasn't last Sunday, some Sunday that that God said that He has so there there's so many books in the Bible, <coughs> especially in the New Testament is what we're focused on, like Galatians and Ephesians and Romans and uh, Corinthians and uh, John, John one through three, Peter one and two. Um, Jude and all of those that all of the letters that were written to the church all the letters that were written to the people that 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 are in the Bible are written f uh, for their for the uh, a certain need of them that that if there was if there was one if there was one um, set how is it father if there was one set one one set way of of a of, uh, well, here, if, if everybody needed the same thing at this at the same time, then then there would only be one book in in, in the New Testament. There would be only one, and, and there would be only uh, there wouldn't be any uh, any way any other uh, any other need for any other book. <coughs> but there, but because that there are more that that because that there are more than one book, and there's one more that one more than one book in the new testament there is there is a need for, there is uh there, there cannot be any uh how is it uh, uh any cookie cutter it can't be cook one one uh like uh, pastor myers church cannot be we cannot we, repairing the breach ministries uh, cannot teach the same thing as as johnstown as Pastor Myers Church, because there's different needs, there's different people. That God and, and and if there were if there was the same need, then there wouldn't be in, <clears throat> then then there wouldn't be any need of, of uh, how's it father? There wouldn't be any need of of uh, of so uh, of of so many varieties of of uh, well, just as the Lord said, so many variety of of books in the Bible. That if 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 John if uh, Pastor Myers teaches the same teaches the same way and, and instructs the same way as as we do down here, there's there there's going to be a lack. There's going to be uh, a lack of something. There's going to be stumbling blocks put before uh, put before uh, uh, more uh, many people up there because for the simple fact that that there's a different need. And that, and this is why Paul here is saying that that everything that he that that was taught was taught by it, 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 he said and, and in verse twelve in Galatians he said I, I was taught I was taught it neither was I taught it but by the revelations of Jesus Christ that only 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 Christ knows what each and every uh, segment. Of a of a of a population needs, there there's there's no way that there can be um, 
one set of one set of guidelines or what not guidelines or, or one one set of 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 way of teaching and <coughs> and, and and that's and that's why each and every everyone that teaches like 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 we, like the Lord said, whether it's Bible study, whether it's vacation Bible school, whether it's Sunday school, whether it's uh, uh, preaching on on Sunday or or Bible study, it it, it has to be. We, we have to uh, give ourselves to 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 um over to the Lord to know what needs to be said, to know what to to know what. To know what he wants to, what he desires to be taught in each in each and every uh, given uh, place, and that it can't that that it, it it can't be anything anything cookie cutter. Okay, let's all right. Let's turn and and uh, turn back to uh, Corinthians. Now <clears throat> he received it. Uh oh, went too far. Oh, First Corinthians. Chapter eleven. We're doing um, communion. Starting at verse twenty-three. That's why he says here. But he says, "For I received, for I have received of the Lord. <coughs> he has received. He has received of the Lord. Uh, <coughs> he has received of the Lord that." Uh, the everything that that he that that Paul writes down, he gives himself fully over um, to to, uh, uh, to to the to the ministry that he was called to be at, and and like the Lord said, that's how each and and not on, not only um, those that are teaching in the church, but er, but everybody uh, is to give themselves. It, it, we're to give ourselves over to Christ, and like Paul said. I, was it Paul says I, I I die daily, and, and that that we are we are to give ourselves over unto God each and every day, um, that we that we can be examples uh, out in this world because like, he he taught us this once before that there there will be there will be times that people will see us will will see will not uh, will see uh yeah will see uh us being that those. That had all of us that have accepted Christ as their personal savior, and and we will be the only examples that they may have to a uh, uh, to 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 a uh, a measure uh, what was that a measuring stick? Why is that like that? Um, th this is how this is how you act uh, uh, when you're saved. This is how you talk when when you're walking with, when you're walking with Christ. This is how you conduct yourself. This is how you hold yourself. And, and for for some people that that we might. Uh, be the only person that that uh, the only um, reflection of Christ that they see, and and if we don't if we don't if we don't uh, be in continuous prayer, be in, in, um, in um, seeking God, uh, asking God to work through us each and every day and and everywhere everywhere we go, everything that we do, that. We could cause somebody to say, "Well, why should I get saved if they're acting if they're acting the uh, same way that I'm acting, or if they're uh, if they're talking the same way that I talk, or if they um, uh, if if they're in a given situation they're acting the same way I would act." And that, that this is why we have to we we have to um, give ourselves over unto the Lord unto the Lord fully. Now. <coughs> Here, the second part that I have received of the Lord. You know that it, that this everything everything after this is is is, is of the Lord that, that he received. It's not his opinion. It's not anything that he was taught. It's not anything. Uh, it, it, it's not it, uh, of anyone else's opinion. It's not his own. It's not anyone else's opinion. No one that that uh, ha, has taught him anything. But it is of the Lord. It's it, it's of the Lord that he that it was given to him. And he says and that also I deliver unto you. Now, this also I deliver unto you that he, it's not being held. Nothing's going to be held back. That everything that the Lord has told him, he he's going to give. He's going to um, he's he's going to uh, give it give it 
speak it speak it to to, to uh, these people at, at, at Corinth that have received this letter it just as uh, where is that where is that at father and um in Acts Acts chapter 20 verse 20 I need a bookmark so I don't lose my page again all right uh -huh. Uh, no, I, I have one. Thanks anyway, kid. Acts chapter 20, verse 20, where it says, where, this is where Paul is addressing the elders of, of, Ephes, of uh, Ephesians. Ephesians. This is and, and and how I kept nothing, how I kept back nothing that was profitable unto you, but but have showed you, and have taught you publicly from house to house. That nothing was kept back. That nothing that that if, if he had a if there was a a, a chance he he would offend somebody. Uh, it, it wasn't that he didn't care it was that he was going to do uh, he was going to speak God's word no matter what and and in in the same <coughs> the same uh, aspect uh, as for today he, he, everyone that that speaks God's word every uh, everyone that will that is uh that's doing the will of the will of uh, our father that that no matter that it's, there's going to be a times that we offend people with some with some things we say or some things that we do that God that God would have us to do or have us to say the words that that we that he would have us to speak will, will uh, offend offend some people at, at some point in time but here, but here at just as what what Paul said he said I, I kept nothing I he said I kept nothing back that was profitable unto you nothing that that's going to cause nothing nothing that's going to cause uh i mean nothing that that's um everything that's going to cause them growth in in their in the walk with with god or everything that's going to that that will cause them uh, uh to be stronger in in their in their faith uh to cause them how teaching them, whether it may be teaching them how to uh, conduct themselves out in the world that nothing should nothing should be held back the same way <clears throat> same thing the same way with with all with us that we can't hold any we can't hold anything back that uh you you have to walk the the, the walk with, when you're walking with god when you when you're saved and 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 you're walking with god you you have to walk with a, a certain uh boldness and a certain uh, uh have and what and a certain boldness in in us and and talk with with with, uh, with authority and i don't mean yelling i don't mean uh letting uh raising your voice above others or or um pounding your opinion down someone's throat I, i'm saying that when you when you're taught when you're walking with boldness you you walk you you uh you know, you know that what God has for you to do, that's what you're going to do. You're not going to bow back, bow down to to any anything anybody else is is, uh, is doing or the opinion they may have. And, and when speaking with boldness, is that not not um, not letting the fear of a uh, not letting any fear come upon you uh, where you may be where where god may have you speaking at. that uh <coughs> where is that um face harder than flint um where is that at is it a is it ezekiel let me see if i can find it real quick uh like uh face let me see. Maybe it's Isaiah. Let me, let's turn to Isaiah. Isaiah chapter chapter fifty. If not, it might be in Ezekiel. 
Isaiah chapter 50, verse 7. Yeah, he's, in verse 7 it says, For the, for the Lord... Hey, wait, maybe we'll read up. Maybe we'll go up, read up. Uh, here, now we'll start at verse 7. It says, For the Lord God will help me, therefore I shall not be confounded. Therefore have I set my face like a flint, and I know that I shall not be ashamed. <coughs> this is that, this is... Isaiah, this is that uh, walking with boldness, knowing that, that he, no matter what, he knows that God has his back. He knows that God is going to uh, um, cause him, cause, uh, not cause him to be, just as it says, uh, um, confounded or, or, or confused. What would I, or let's see, it says disgrace. Another, my Bible says uh, disgraced in front of any in front of anyone and go ahead turn it let's turn to Ezekiel chapter what is that chapter 3 uh, maybe chapter 3 chapter 3 verse 9 is that the one I'm looking for yeah chat we'll start at uh ver start at verse 8 we're gonna start at verse 8 where's it in where it says, and this is the this is uh in my Bible it says the commission of Ezekiel at the top, and he says, behold I have, behold I have made thy face <clears throat> stronger than their faces, and thy forehead strong against their foreheads, as an ambient, adamant adamant, <laughs> as an adamant harder than flint. Have I made thy forehead? Fear them not, neither be dismayed at their looks though they though they be a rebellious house adamant or uh what's, what's another let's see oh, adamant stone that these these are uh, the, the walking with boldness walking with boldness and, and speaking with, with authority that 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 we're talking about where we're uh we're paul we're paul here in acts what we just read, where he said he kept nothing back. This is that talk, uh, talking and, and not, um, not worrying about the opinions of those that that are around you or those that that will judge what you say and 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 may may even take offense in 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 what you say. But but to content, but to know that know that uh, uh, when when you're when you're walking with God, when when you're doing His will, when when he has when he has sent you out to do and to say what it is that you're saying that that just says in what where was that at in Isaiah where it says that you it won't you won't be disgraced or confounded disgraced or or in, in any way and in and in uh, Ezekiel where it says that he, he that God has set his face harder than oh, what is that hard, harder than <coughs> made his forehead at an adamant at it at yeah, adamant harder than harder than flint he says i have i have made thy forehead that he that he that no matter how hard their looks may be that you won't break no matter um no, no matter what is said to you no matter how many come up against you you're not going to fold you're not going to turn uh, put tuck your tail between your legs and run on you're going to say everything that needs to be said you're going to uh speak everything that needs to be spoken and and that's what that's what uh, we, we said. That's what Paul said in, in Acts, and in what what he says here. That uh, which in back at uh, Corinthians chapter eleven, First Corinthians chapter eleven, where he says, "For I have received of the Lord, and also with that which also I delivered unto you." That with, with boldness that he he's going he's speaking this to them because if you uh. If we read the in um, where is that at, Father? Where is that at? In verse in verse seventeen, this is where verse seventeen to verse uh. To verse twenty twenty two, he's he he's scolding them that that he's saying that here, in, in verse starting at verse seven seventeen uh First Corinthians chapter eleven verse seventeen, it says now. Now in this. 
that I declare unto you. I, pra I praise you not that ye come together not for be not for the better, but for the worse. For for first of all, when ye come together in the church, I hear there there that there are divisions among you, and I partly believe it. And that for there must be also there for there must be also heresies among you, that they which are approved may be made manifest among you. When ye come when when ye come together therefore come into one place that is not to eat that is not to eat the Lord's Supper. For eat for in eating everyone for in eating everyone taketh before uh, before others his own <clears throat> his own supper and and no and and one is hungry and others and and another drunken what do we what have you not have you have you not houses to eat and, and, and to drink in or despise ye the, the the church of God and shame them that have not what shall I what shall I say unto you <clears throat> what shall I praise shall I praise you in this I praise you not this is the boldness that's coming out uh, out of Paul not not caring if if because he's speaking what God would have him to speak that there are people that are offended by him <clears throat> and he even tells them that that, that there there in, in verse 19 where, where he says that there are, there must be also heresies among you that they which are approved may be made manifest among you that that even though that that even though he he's a uh, uh, scolding all of them but there there's people there that that truly want to uh truly want to uh uh take part in in, in the lord's supper and and those that that those that he that that he lifts up that they just like with, with with god god might god uh, uh uh scold he might scold us for something that we may do but but he's also going to lift up he's also going to uh, uh um house it he's he's also going to uh not He's not going to leave us, but here, but but here, Paul, Paul is Paul is not. He's. It doesn't matter who who gets offended if if he if 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 he's speaking what God would have him to speak. It's not. It's not going to matter who's getting uh, who's offended by it if they all learn from it. And that this is what I said. That this is this is that the uh, boldness. Speaking with boldness, or walking with boldness, and speaking with with authority, and that here, and that here, he, we're we're back in verse twenty three. Says, "I delivered unto you." This is the same thing that that he's doing, and now we're go, going on. It says that the Lord, <clears throat> uh, I mean, I lost my place. That the Lord Jesus Christ, the same night in which he was betrayed, uh, took bread. Starting this off and and letting letting the the the, the beginning of, of this that this this the, the in the same night the the new uh, covenant that was given to him that we'll go over um, later on that <coughs> that the the um, <coughs> that the, the, the same the same night that he that he was betrayed he. That he was betrayed took bread and and we're gonna in verse 24 it goes on even further with this that that it, it was Christ that that took it it was Christ that blessed it was Christ that did did it all there was no there was no um there was no uh how is it there was no 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 go between from uh Christ and his disciples it, it was it was it was him and his disciples that that it was him that that gave to his disciples um straight on and uh and and just as uh <clears throat> let me see no no let's go over that <coughs> but th this oh, i thought you want to say something did you want oh, okay that it said it says here that the same night he was in 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 which he was betrayed that that he knew Christ knew that he was going to be betrayed. Christ knew that he was going to be, um, um, 
given over. And uh, here in, in uh, where is it at? In Mark. No, that's just in one, in, in one place, but it's, it's in Matthew and Matthew, Mark, and Luke. But here we're going to turn to um, Mark chapter 14. Let's see, Mark chapter 14, verse, uh, oh, that's verse 13, 14, verse, uh, chapter 14, verse 18, where it says, and, and as they sat and did eat, <coughs> Jesus said, Jesus said, verily I say unto you, one of you which eat, which eat with me shall betray me. I mean, he Christ knew who it was. Christ knew that that it was gonna that it was gonna happen, and and he and, and he. I mean, the, throughout this, the the whole time it, it was given an opportunity for re, repentance, and that that opportunity to to uh, um, to ask forgiveness, which was to which was to 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 Judas. They, they but. Uh, Christ knew that it, there, there was not going to happen, but God puts it forth uh, continuously e e to him, even still. And that's why he wasn't uh, thrown or casted out before then. But, but even Christ knew that that right here that he was going to be betrayed, that he was going to be um, de de delivered up, and he still went on. He he still went on. Um, <coughs> He still went on uh, uh, with the with with uh, uh, the the whole with him giving himself upon the cross, letting himself be crucified, and and <clears throat> and, and I see where are we at back in First Corinthians. He said uh, that saying that he he which in which he took the bread, and this is where Paul is, is, is start. This is where Paul is, is starting um, the 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 whole well the first. Uh, one, two, three chapters is is the 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 um speaking uh speaking of of the 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 um giving of himself that the new cut the broken the bread being broken for them in a cup in the uh cup I mean the, the in, in the blood and everything doing in in remembrance of, of of God. But here, but he starts out that he knew that Christ knew what was going on. Christ knew that he would that he was going to be um that he was that he was uh, going to be uh, given over to him and and going back. This this is why Paul started um in verse twenty three that saying that I've received of the Lord because all of this that that he that um he's going to be writing to to to, to Corinth. If there if if there's uh, any any inkling of, of flesh that that is still in it, it's it's going to cause any it's going to cause uh, um, so many to, to to fall. That here in in um where is it at in in, in Isaiah um, fifty five was that chapter fifty five verse eight and verse nine. Turn to it. Make sure I got wrote down the right one. Yeah, verse eight and verse nine, where Isaiah writes, "For my thoughts are not are not your thoughts, neither are are your ways my ways," saith the Lord. For as heaven, <coughs> for as, for as heaven, as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts your thoughts this is why this this is why we have to give ourselves over to God no matter what we're doing no matter where we're at because because no one can know 
uh, what God would have them to do. Uh, yeah, God. No one can read God's mind. No, there, there's no help in God along. The, there's just hindering His work from happening. It, whenever we try to, uh, whenever we, we try to to go in front of Him, and and, and try to um and and, and try to uh, um help Him along. But in in, in the same sense, we'll we'll read down to uh, verse. Here we we'll read te verse ten and eleven here in, in Isaiah. But when we do that, just like with, with Paul, with, with Paul, when when he um, he said by uh, say in Isaiah, I'm just flipping back real quick, just so I don't say it wrong. He says, "For I have received of the Lord that which I delivered unto you, that er, that when he gave himself unto the Lord. He knows that that he can't, he himself cannot uh, cannot." Uh, discern what what God would have would have spoken and when we and when all when we all do that when we all pray and give ourselves unto him that here in verse 10 and verse 11 is is a uh, uh well here verse um let's see where where is it at verse 11 it says so so my so shall my word well here we're, okay we'll read verse 10 as well it says for as rain cometh down and snow from heaven and returneth not thither but watereth the <coughs> watereth the earth and maketh it and maketh it bring forth the bud and, and make bring forth and bud that that it may give seed to the sower and bread to the eater so shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth it shall not return <coughs> it shall not return unto me void but it shall accomplish that which that which I please, and it shall prosper in a thing where where to I send it. That whenever we do, whenever we do God's uh, uh, word, speak His words with the with the boldness and and, and and the authority that that He would have us to do it. That nothing that we that nothing that we speak is going to fall to the ground. There's not going to be, uh, it's not it's not going to be wasted words. It's not going to be uh it's not gonna be uh, uh empty uh, emptiness that goes that that uh uh that fall that that falls with no purpose <clears throat> and wait till this bell's done but everything that that is spoken is, is spoken um to 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 uh fulfill what 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 God would have it to to fulfill and who God would have it to touch and who um the hungry those those that are hungry or those that need that uh um that need that that spark that extra push to to um to come like with Corinth those that are those that have fallen away those that are, those that are doing things wrong in the wrong way that they may need that push that 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 uh their eyes open to see the the wrong that they're doing just like what uh job did who was that Nin, Nineveh Ninevites Jonah yeah Jonah with the Nin, was it the Ninevites mm -hmm. they didn't know that they were doing things wrong but he pointed it out to them and and so uh you got to read Jonah but but they they got they got right back on they got on the right track and here in, at Corinth, they they may know what the, they know that they're, what they're doing is wrong, but they may need that. that but they're getting that push back in. The, some might be getting that push in the right back in the right direction. Yes. I thought it was Nahum. Nahum. Or is that the person? Nahum instead. Of... It was Jonah. Was... You might be thinking of another book. No, it was Jonah. But here, but but here, Paul, the the, the words that Paul speak that that Paul is speaking, giving giving himself over into Christ, um, <clears throat> not holding back anything that God would have him have him to say to them, is is going to is going to um, fill fill the hearts of those that that are that that desire to receive it. That it's not going to fall flat. It's not going to fall empty. 
it's going to fulfill everything that God would have it to would have it to fulfill and 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 he's not going to be shy on doing it he's not going to bow down thinking that he's going to offend somebody or that he's going to lose uh lose a lose a friend or, or, or two because of it but he, but he's going to go on and um and go on and, and do everything that that need that needs to be done that needs to be said <clears throat> okay and we'll stop there any any questions no everybody got it so far mm -hmm. i was remembering a few weeks ago i was reading in second corinthians where paul talks about that and they repented some of them <coughs> where is that he at said, um, second corinthians 7 verse 8 i don't know if he's second corinthians 7 10. verse 8 where it says, for though I made, uh, if he's referring, though I made you sorry with the letter, I do not, I do not repent. Though I do, I did repent for, a, for I perceived that the same, same epistle hath made you sorry, though it were <coughs> but for a season. Yeah, go ahead, rejoice on this one. Verse nine. Oh, go ahead. Read your ver read verse nine. Yet now I am happy, not because you you were made sorry, but because your sorrow led led you to repentance. For you became sorrow, as God in intended, and so and so not harmed. That the the his, the letter was the the whether it was first Corinth the letter from first Corinthians or another letter that he wasn't sorry that he wrote it. He was uh he he was sorry that that it um. Or is that? That it was sorry that that it they they um uh how does it say that? He's not sorry that he wrote it, but he's sorry that so it hurt. It hurt them, yeah. Alright, he he wasn't go he's not he 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 wasn't gonna take back what he the 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 uh, correction that God had for him to deliver it to them. He but he he's he's uh he he's he's sorry that it hurt them, but he wasn't gonna hold back that hurt. Um. He wasn't gonna uh, uh spare their feelings of that of what he said, <clears throat> because it it caused them. It, it caused them to go on the right track, or or caused some to go to to turn back on the right track and to do what it is that that need, that um uh to to that needed to be done. Okay, you got it. Yeah. All right. <coughs> now next week, uh, we're gonna we'll go at man. We didn't even finish one verse. All right, next we would do verse twenty. <laughs> verse 24 <laughs> all right uh everybody has that down um you can read over verse 20 well you can read over the whole thing all of the um from verse from verse 23 to verse what is that verse 23 to the uh to the end to verse 34 you can study that for yourselves as well and now if there's there's any out there that that had that are watching this and the desires to accept Christ as your personal savior you can do so that you don't there's no need for any uh, any long speeches any any uh, prepared words that once your heart burns for burns for the Lord that all you, you could just lift up your voice or, or or if you want to say within yourself <clears throat> that's fine as well that that to to uh, to uh, uh, invite Jesus into your heart, uh, to 
say that that you're a sinner and that you know you need to be saved and that you uh, that that your desire is for him to come into your heart and to lead your life on to to uh, start you a new pathway and a pathway that he has for you and and, and like like we said there there's there's no big words that you have to that you have to say there's there's no uh, long speeches there's nothing that needs to be said <coughs> it's just your heart once your heart is after when goes after uh, uh, goes after God. That is all that you need. And uh, once God sees your heart turn toward Him, He's going to come and and, and uh, come toward you. And once you accept Christ as a personal Savior, once you invite Him into your heart, uh, that that's that's that that's when salvation starts for you. And 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 as 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 you. Uh, had accept Christ as your personal savior. The first, the your the first thought to to is to pray and and ask the Lord to send you, uh, to lead you to a church, that He would have you to go to. That would have that that would help that would have you help you to grow, in, in your in your walk with God and your faith, um, to Him. And and when you when you end the prayer, always end your prayer in the name of Jesus. But as, as if you desire to do so, just if you the burn if that burning is is within you, <clears throat> go ahead and, and accept Christ and, and and speak the words of salvation to uh, like I said within yourself or out loud if you if 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 the spirit if if our Father Spirit moves you to do so, and if there's any prayer requests, there are e the email is down at the bottom of the screen. Prayer at, at rtbministries.us, and and you send and once you send uh, email your request your re uh, prayer request in, we'll get right right up right on that. And once again, it's at prayer at rtbministries.us, <coughs> and we we uh, have ser we have hold services uh, at on Sunday at twelve noon. What we'll be streaming here streaming from. Uh, streaming from UStream uh, <laughs> at at around tw at twelve, or broadcasting from UStream at 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 twelve, and you're welcome to uh, welcome to join us once again, or if you desire to come out and, and join us in person, we're uh, off uh, um, in Elizabeth Town, off the Route two eighty two eighty three uh, on the, off the Elizabeth Town Reams exit. Off of Route 283, and and, and uh, we we'll welcome you to join to join with us if you desire to do that on uh, in person. Now, if there's nothing else to be said, if there's no questions, no statements, let's all pray, pray to be pray to be done, dear Father. <clears throat> we thank you and we praise you, dear Lord, for being with us, guiding and keeping and standing on with us, dear Father. We thank you, dear Lord, just for um prospering, guiding, and keeping us, dear Father, in the name of Jesus, dear Lord. And I pray unto you, dear Father, to guide and keep and stand with us as we continue on throughout this week, dear Father. I pray unto you in the name of Jesus, just to guide and keep and stand with us, dear Father, surrounding us with your angels of protection and reminding us uh, to, to walk in the way that you would have us to go. I pray, dear Father, give us victory over this world, good health upon everyone, dear Father, in the name of Jesus, dear Lord, and there be no continued peace upon the homes and the, and, and the families, dear Father, of all of your hungry, dear Lord, in the name of Jesus, dear Father, and continue teaching and guiding and being with us, dear Father, throughout this week, dear Lord, and bless us to come uh, back again into this, your Bible study next week, dear Father, and as well, uh, uh, bless us to join together on Sunday in, in your services, and, and <clears throat> in Jesus' name, we thank you and we praise you, dear Father, in Jesus' name we pray, amen. Yeah.